What is going on, fellow farmers? Welcome back to another Beginner's Guide Tutorial with your boy CG Farms right here on Farm Simulator 22. Today, guys, I'm going to be showing you how to make Total Mix Ration, as this is an amazing food for your cattle, and it will push their productivity up um, a lot. So, uh, with that being said, guys, let's get right into this. Now, to make Total Mix Ration, and we're going to be using... Um, we're going to be using uh, base game mods, so anything that comes with the game, that's what we're going to be using. Uh, if we go in, the first thing I'm going to be using, guys, is the Silo King, and you're going to need some type of telehandler as well, and these, um, we're going to need this uh, mineral feed right here as well. Uh, in FS22, they did add mineral feed for the for the uh, total mix ration. So, with that being said, the first thing we're going to look at is the Silo King. Let's go into the store. Let's go to tools and you just want to go down to animals all right and you'll find that silo king right here okay it is let's see what is the capacity on this does it say where's the capacity at capacity capacity where's the capacity on this thing what was that right there nope does not say what the capacity is now that's rather weird i did not see anything about capacity I don't see anything about it okay so with the but keep this in mind with this silo king I'm going to show you how to make total mix ration. Now, when it comes to total mix ration, uh, it, it's more about math. It's more about math. 25% of this, 25% of that, 50% of this, you know, uh, yada, 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 et cetera, et cetera. It's all about math, and it's all about getting in here and just experimenting with this and figuring out what you can and cannot do because you don't want to mess up your mix because once you mess up your mix, you'll have to dump it out and restart, okay? So... The first thing we're going to do is, um, and the next thing you'll probably need is like a telehandler or something like this uh, with a pallet fork for your mineral feed and a bell spike for your bells. So if we go into the store and go to tools and then go down to let's see where the, oh, I'm sorry, go up to vehicles, go to vehicles and then go down to telehandlers. Uh, the one I am using is actually right here. This is the one I'm using right here. Um, it prices at $105,000. And then if you want a bell spike or pallet for it, go down to tools. And then you want to go down to telehandler tools, okay? And here you're going to find the bell spike as well as the pallet fork right here, okay? Now there's different bell stuff. Like this right here, like the wrapped wrap bell handler. I've never cared too much about this myself, although I did use it in 15 quite a bit because I liked it in 15. I have not tried in this one, but we're going to be doing uh, testing videos on different... Uh, mods and how they work and all that as people have been requesting me for to, to do that so but that's a different video let's exit back out that's where you get your tools and your mineral feed mineral feed is going to be uh in the store it's going to be under what is this under it is under objects and it's under pallets right here okay if you go all the way to the end there is your mineral feed right here okay now they don't sell in bulk quantity like that they just sell in one pallet all right, so we're going to exit out. Now, the first thing we want to do is we want to we want to jump into our tractor. All right, you're going to have to have a tractor to run this right here. All right, so you're going to start the tractor up, and you are going to look up in your window, and it will say to uh, turn on the mixer wagon. That's exactly what you want to do, okay? And we're going to pull this. We're going to pull this right down, uh, say, like right here. And you want to leave your tractor running, because if you turn your tractor off, the mixing wagon will go off, okay? So we're going to turn that off, and we're going to jump into our telehandler. All right, and I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to detach that real quick. And if I can, I'm going to get that, um, I'll tell you how I'm going to get that, um, <clears throat> that pallet, that bell fork right there. I'm going to do it like this. I'm going to use my super strength so I can turn it around. All right, well, so we're going to, we're going to take it out here and I'm going to drop it just like that. Uh, if you guys haven't heard, the new lumberjack mod is out and uh, it does come with a super strength mod. Uh, so it's pretty cool. I actually enjoyed it. I really like that mod. I'm glad they brought that into FS22. So what we're going to do next is now for total mix ration with this particular Silo King. Okay, you're going to need one round straw bell, two round hay bells, two round silage, silage bells, and um, not the whole pallet of mineral feed, but you might as well say the whole pallet because it takes all the pallet but just a few bags. Okay, so... And I'll show you what I mean by that. So we're gonna grab, we're gonna go ahead and grab our one straw bell here. We're gonna go ahead and grab that. There we go. 
Oh, and we tipped one off. That's perfectly okay. Now, the reason I do recommend getting a telehandler to do this, guys, is because of the reach. See the reach on it? I love the reach on the telehandlers. I love it. I love the way they just, uh, they have that reach and, and they just, I don't know, I just love the telehandlers. Okay, so once your mix of wagons on, you're going to grab a bell straw, you're going to bring it over. All right, we're going to lift this up. We're going to lift it up. We're going to take it down. And I do want to bring this over where you guys can kind of see it drop in as well. Uh, because it is really cool the way it the way it the way it works if I can get it to work right. Alright, and we're just gonna drop that in there like that. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There goes the bell, and it will stay there for a minute. Remember in FS19, guys, it would just go in there and just mix immediately. But see how it takes a second? So there is the one straw bell. Now, if we hop out of here and we hop into the tractor real quick, okay? Uh, you will see right there in your straw that you have 100% straw, okay? You have 100% straw. All right, that's good. As long as those lines are in the green, you're good to go. You are good to go, all right? So we're going to go ahead and we're going to hop into our telehandler again. And we are now going to grab two rounds of hay, two round bells of hay. Now, it has to be the round bells. I have to do it like this because your square bells are different uh, liter capacities. So just keep that in mind. And we're going to grab these two right here. And we're going to bring these over here as well. Now, you'll know if you mess up your mix because your lines will be in the red. That's how you know you mess up your mix, okay? All right, so we're going to go like that. Take it out. Bring them down. All right, and there goes our... Our hay. Now if we hop out, and if I can get myself turned around here and we hop back into the tractor, all right, you'll now see that we are in the red, okay? But if we add, if we add some silage to that, all right? I hope I said that right while we go, guys. One round straw bell, two round hay bells, and two round silage bells. I hope I said that right the first time. Now. Let me make sure I said that right. So for the Silo King, you're gonna need one round straw bell, two round hay bells, and two round silage bells, which are these right here. Now you can find those in your store. If you go to your store and go to objects and go over to bells, you can find them right here. Here is your round hay bell, okay? There is your round silage bell, and there's your round straw bell right there, okay? All right, so let's go ahead and hop back in the telehandler, and we're gonna go ahead and grab our two, um, our two sideways bells here. But I hope you guys enjoyed the video, man. I hope you guys enjoyed these tutorials. Let me push these out of the way. Yeah, get out of the way there. And we're gonna grab these two round sideways bells right here. There we go. We got those. Get them on there. And now we're gonna drop these. Now, once we drop our sideways bells, it should even those red numbers right out. All right. Let's put this up. Go up with it and bring it down. All right, there goes our silage bells. And you can see the trailer start to fill up there. We're going to hop out. We're going to hop at the tractor. And as you can see, we have 90, We now have total mixed ration. We have 95% total mixed ration, but we want 100% total mixed ration. Now, nonetheless, you can take this and feed it to your cows, and it's going to be good food. You're going to have total mixed ration for your cattle, but... What we need to add at the bottom there, you'll see that little bag uh, in the in the in the window there in the help window at the bottom, where it says 0.0%. You see that little bag? That is our mineral food. Okay. So what we want to do is at this point, we're gonna hop back in here. And I'm gonna show you guys how to do this step for step here. We're gonna detach that, and we're gonna go over and grab that pallet fork there real quick. And this game leaves terrible tracks. I'll be glad when they come out with a mob where we can remove the tire tracks. All right, so we're going to grab that, and now we are going to get, we're going to move this out of the way. We're going to move these straw bells out of the way. Just get those on over there. Oh, I didn't know we could pick it up with that. I did not know we could do that. Let me get that off of there. All right, so now we're going to pick up this pallet here, and these can be a little bit finicky. All right, so now we got our pallet, our mineral food. And you're just going to take this over here. Now, you're not going to dump it in. You're not going to dump it in. So, kind of keep that in mind. Don't tip it over when you get there. You're just going to walk over, uh, drive over like this. You're going to let it take the bags. 
Just like that. It's gonna take all, it's gonna take all that it needs. It won't take more than what it needs, okay? So it takes everything but two bags, okay? Everything but two bags. Alright. Alright, so as you can see, it took everything except for two bags. Let's go ahead and hop in our tractor. And we now have 100% total mixed ration, and our numbers are in the green. So that's a good thing. So it takes pretty much the whole pallet except for, like I said, two packs. It just takes the, the two packs on there um, is the only thing it doesn't take. Um, but that is pretty much it on how to make total mixed ration. We now have 100% total mixed ration right here, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. Um, like I said, again, it takes one round straw bale, two round hay bales, and two round silage bales, and a whole pallet except excluding two bags of mineral feed okay guys and that's how you'll make total mixed ration now that works in the silo king as far as the other ones go i have not taken the time to experiment with them so if i go in here and go down to animals and my tools uh they do have different wagons here that you can buy this one here looks like it's about the same capacity but don't hold me to that um i don't see anywhere it has capacity i still don't see that um i and they also have the uh coon augie mixing wagon right here now i believe this one takes the same mix as the silo king um the augie wagon does i used to use this in fs19 for total mix ration i'm pretty sure it takes the same kind of mix um of the same value of mix so like one straw uh two hay two silage i think it takes the same mix but don't hold me to that but we might experiment with this in a little bit later tutorial and because uh, i'm going to be testing a lot of these mods out and doing testing videos and giving my honest opinion on them and how i think they work and grading them uh, so, with that being said, guys and girls, that is pretty much it for uh, how to make Total Mix Ration right there. That's pretty much how it works. Uh, that is it, guys and girls. Uh, subscribe if you're new. Smash that like button for me and click that bell and click all so you know exactly when I post new content as we do tutorials over here, daily tutorials, mod reviews, and we will soon be doing gameplay as well. With that being said, I love you guys so much. Until next time, this is CJ Farms. And one crop at a time, we are helping America grow. I will see you all in the next video.